going on, y'all? Welcome to my channel. Excuse your visor. In the building. What's up, y'all? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, let's get a read now. Let's do this. I don't have a lot of time. I got to go to the um, British shop, get my hair done and stuff. And I'm finna go buy me some um chocolate covered strawberries and um pineapples and bananas. Yeah, I can buy my own strawberries. Okay, so let's get started. Whatever come out is what the uh, spirit wants you to know. LA, what you doing? They know one must see about it. They know one don't give a fuck. Glitching. Okay, so we have high priest, high priest, or high priest. Okay, high priestesses, or am I saying it right? High priest or high priest, okay? Responsibility. Oh my God, I can totally relate to these. Okay, so look, you know, let me be in the high priestess, right? Not a high priest. Y'all know I'm tired of talking, you know. Y'all know I'm turning to so I have priestess. But we been a high priest. Y'all know it is a lot that comes with it, right? A lot of responsibilities that come with um being who you are, right? Um, yeah, because I feel the same way, even though I know that I've you know I'm helping um humanity or helping people, right? Um, but it seems like it's never enough or my job is never done or I have more to do. I always feel like um, you know, there's more to do. You know what I'm saying? I always feel like, I mean, I feel like you just should never get content where you are. You know what I'm saying? You should never, um, don't, don't get comfortable with where you are because you should always want more. I don't know. I just feel like I, um, you know, it's just a big responsibility, you know, you know, dealing with family, then dealing with, um, you know, just work. I don't even call it work because it's something that I so love to do. But I just feel like it's a big responsibility. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like collective, maybe you feel like it's a big responsibility, um, you know, in this profession, what we do. You know what I'm saying? Because we do have to be there for um, people and ourselves as well. You know what I'm saying? If we don't take care of ourselves, how are we going to help you all? You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. I feel like they could relate to someone. If you are high priest or high priestess. Okay. We have cloak. Okay. So now... Somebody's cloaking themselves. See them? Yep. Somebody's cloaking themselves. Maybe you have to. Hold on, let's get some more cards. What's this message here? What are you trying to say? Respect. Put some respect on my name. Put some respect on my name. Okay, your ancestors are here. It says remembrance. I don't know why I'm like here, like in remembrance of your ancestors. Okay. Okay, so what I'm totally getting. Oh yeah, respect. Okay, I see your ancestors or uh, think highly of you. Um okay, so somebody's ancestors could be really celebrating them. You know what I'm saying? We have intentions with the wand here. So I feel like somebody's being somebody's being celebrated, okay? I don't know. Somebody's ancestor could be trying to teach you how to cloak yourself, okay? Okay, it might be necessary for somebody to learn how to cloak themselves, okay? I'm also seeing somebody like doing some. Okay, so I don't see um. Yep. Herbal kitchen on the bottom of the deck. So somebody's into her herbs and stuff like that. Herbal uh, kitchen. But I'm also getting like, um, I'm seeing somebody do some type of spare work, but it's not like um, bad spare work. It's good spare work. You know, like if I do my little spare work, I don't do no bad spare work. Only good spare work. But, you know, like money magic and stuff like that. Um, I'm somebody's doing it or somebody's doing some with some herbs or something like that. Or whoever you are, you're a healer and you're into uh, herbal, herbal, herbal things. You know what I'm saying? Herbal kitchen in the kitchen, um, cooking it up or mixing different. You know what I'm saying? With the little um, with the little bowl how you can put your stuff in. You can. I'm saying somebody do that, okay? And um, 
I don't know, somebody's like, you doing it the same way. Whoever you are, you doing it the same way your ancestors do it. You know what I'm saying? That makes sense. And your ancestors are like, shit, they better put some respect on your name. Somebody's like, ancestors not bullshitting. Do you understand me? Yeah, somebody doing some type of protection spell or something. Um, one, two, three, four, five. I could, I'm seeing like, let me see. Could be five people doing some type of, um, why am I hearing cauldron? Cauldron? Something about a cauldron, but, um, I can see one, two, three. Got like five people doing some type of work. They setting their attention on something. Even if y'all not doing this together, it could be separate. Um, y'all may not even know each other, but I'm just saying like five people do some type of spare work or set some type of attention or somebody trying to cloak themselves for. Like I said, your ancestors trying to show you how to cloak yourself. I'm also saying like your ancestors, like somebody need to um uh somebody's being celebrated by their ancestors. Uh, your ancestors want you to talk to them more. You know what I'm saying? Get to know them better. Okay, let's see. Okay, we have a witch cottage security. I don't know. I'm talking to a witch. A witch doctor. Maybe you find out that you was a, a witch in in the summer, like last summer or something. I don't know. Okay, okay so let's get some more cards. Okay, so whoever you are, like I said, I feel like you have like a big responsibility, right? I don't know. Maybe you're learn, learning how to cloak yourself because it's very relevant. Because I keep saying it like... It's very relevant that you learn to cloak yourself. And then look, good advice from a wise person. I feel like this is me telling you to learn how to clone, cloak yourself. Somebody needs to learn how to cloak. Or you're learning how to cloak yourself. Somebody's learning magic or candle magic. Or somebody doing some type of candle magic. Or you're learning or you want to know more about candle magic. You know what I'm saying? Or somebody's doing some type of magic and they send their attentions. Whether it's on crystals. I'm seeing somebody set attentions with crystals. I'm also seeing somebody set attentions. Um, like, uh, ooh, I'm hearing holy war. Okay, maybe you should set your attention with your holy war. Somebody, so I feel like somebody may have went about some of this Florida water like this right here. Holy war and uh, could be like setting their attentions with that. Or setting their attentions around their house, making sure that their house is secure. You know what I'm saying? Making sure that their family is secure. Somebody could have a black cat. I don't know who I'm talking to. So you a high priest or high priest and you have a black cat because it's a cat right here. And their cat is protecting you, okay? Whoever got a cat, their cat is protecting your home. Whether it's a black or, or it could be any color cat. Tom cat, white cat, black cat, blue cat. It don't matter. Um, this, this cat is protecting your home. It's right there. See, see the cat? Can y'all see the baby? Can you see the kitty? Right there. Yeah. Okay, I'm hearing fairy dust. So, I don't know. Somebody could be a fairy. <laughs> I don't know. Can you be like a fairy witch? You know what I'm saying? Okay, somebody needs to put some respect on your name. Whoever you have a two faced friend in your midst, it lasted right on, it it landed right on top of um respect. You know what I said? Somebody needs to put some respect on your name. Maybe they maybe um people be saying that you're a witch or something. I don't know. She it is what it is at this point. But somebody around you is two faced, even if it's not a friend, it's somebody, you know what I'm saying? See how they land around on top of intentions. It said new opportunities, possibilities, and paths are opening up. So yeah, I do feel like um with the intentions and the new opportunities, someone is um sent some type of um intentions because it landed right on top of intentions. Maybe you send some type of tension on a, um some new opportunity business or whatever this is, or you send opportunity for your pathway to op open up whatever you're doing. Okay, keep doing whatever you're doing. Okay. Then we have psychic abilities, treasure, intuition. Yeah, on the bottom of the deck. 
Ooh. So we have psychic abilities and we have um high priest in uh high priest or high priest high priestess or high priest responsibilities and we have psychic abilities to shut your intuition. So I, I do feel like I'm talking to a high priest or a high priestess. You know what I'm saying? And you feel like right now you have a lot of responsibilities, but it get easier. I feel like you're not, I feel like you, you haven't been in the game long, maybe a, a couple of years or something like that. But yeah, whatever you're doing is going to bring prosperity to you. This, um, this thing you do, this, this little thing you do. Okay, let's see. Cloaking. But just just know that your ancestors see you and they're here with you and they're protecting you and they see you because they have they came right out. Okay. So we have someone will be gossiping about gossiping about all your secrets. Maybe that's who you're trying to I don't know, clone yourself for. I don't know. Okay, uh, um clone your energy. Somebody's trying to clone their energy or something. Or I can look at it like um somebody's trying to clone themselves, cloak. Not clone, y'all. I'm sorry. Somebody's trying to clone their self. It could be this fake-ass friend. I don't know. They don't want you to know who really doing it behind the scenes, so they're trying to cloak their self. I don't know. Somebody could be hating on you or gossiping about you, um, and they in disguise. They don't want you to know who the hell they are. Okay, I can look at it like that, because if you look at this person right here, um... You can't see who that is. You can't see who that is. This remind me of that dream I had when them three them three uh men in black came to me in my dreams. They looked just like this. I couldn't see their face or anything. Usually when you dream, when you have a dream and you dream and you see like somebody's face covered up, that means you know this person, right? Guess what the fuck this is? You feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or gold. Okay, so look, yeah, and then you, like I said, usually in the dream when when you when you when you see somebody covering their face up, they don't want you to know who they are, so you know this person. So whoever this two faced friend is, someone who will gossip about all your secrets, then they gossip about all your secrets. They don't want you to know who the hell they are. You know what I'm saying? They hide. They hide who they are. They done cloak themselves or something like that. Or like I said, you need to learn how to cloak yourself. Maybe you've been trying to set some attentions or do some type of magic or I'm even seeing water magic here. Okay, what's up going on with this two-faced friend? Well, okay, so it's like ever since you step into this spiritual journey, um or whatever, I don't know, people could be calling you a witch or whatever, I don't know. But ever since you stepped into this spiritual journey, people been gossiping about you or gossiping about all your secrets or they think they know all your secrets and don't know shit. You know what I'm saying? Your birthday could be in June. But I want to see, let's see, what is this, um, what is this person here? This person that's talking about you gossiping about all your secrets or whatever this is. Because it looks like you're not studying this shit because you're stepping into new business opportunities. Like, yeah, troubles and accusations. Want to know who I'm signed to? <laughs> Not you. Okay, so I don't know where I'm hearing this. When, um, money back yesterday, they want to know who I'm signed to. All in your business. Somebody like, all in your business. Don't worry about who, what I'm doing. Don't worry about if I'm a wish. Don't worry about what I'm over here doing. Don't worry about it. Troubles and accusations. Bro, we have the score amongst friends and family. Then we have good news. So, this the score amongst friends and family. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. So I feel like this could be your family and a, and, and a two faced friend. You know what I'm saying? Everybody who was around you, because I'm not feeling like these people are uh, around you anymore. You know what I'm saying? But you do have some good news here. On the bottom of the deck, it say time to go out and have fun. You know, with me, this this like a message for me because I don't go out and do nothing. And like I got a cousin that's having a party coming up, but he's at the club. Y'all know I don't do the club thing. Even when I was doing the club thing, my back always up against the wall. Like I don't, I'm just not the club type. You know what I'm saying? I will go and support my fam. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just not into the like people like me clubs. They don't. Mm -mm. I'd rather be laid back. I feel more comfortable at the movies or something like that. You know what I'm saying? So that's where I'm going with that, but look like you got some good news. <laughs> some type of good news. Somebody have did some type of um like um uh, money magic, um uh, some money spell or something like that, and it's about to um 
Bitch, about to hit your ass. Somebody did some type of money spell. I'm talking about when it come back around and boom around and back around and hit your ass, you ain't gonna know what happened. I feel like that's the good news right here. It got something to do with some money. But we finna see though. Or your ancestors, somebody's ancestors could be about to bless them. Okay, I'm thinking about like spiritual inheritance in my head. Okay. I could be wrong, but you know, I don't think so. Let me see, what is this? What is this good news? Okay, you could be a female energy here. Or you could be a masculine energy. You could be a masculine in your female energy. Okay. Okay, you whoever you are, I feel like you is yeah. I feel like you be exposing things because you are a high priest or high priest, right? I just seen exposing so I feel like you be exposing things or whatever. Yeah, I'm telling you, look, you're an empath, right? You expose things, high priest or high priestess. Damn, they came out. They don't even supposed to be over here. So we got brother. And we do have family member. So um maybe um your brother gossip about you, you know what I'm saying? Or or they tell your secrets. Or have told your secrets. Okay, we have it will happen overnight. Okay, I don't know what because I'm seeing a lot of stars. So I was finna say something about like you could be a star or a star in the making is what I'm hearing, but like every picture, damn it got stars. Like you light up you light up the world or you know what I'm saying, you light the way, you know what I'm saying, or something like that. But it says it will happen overnight. So I feel like whatever you, you <clears throat> I feel like a star overnight or something. Yeah, look, searching for you. Somebody could be searching for you. Okay, whatever this is, it's going to happen overnight. I don't know. Hmm. Ooh, too many cards. That was too many cards, y'all. That was way too many. Way too many. I can't make this shit up. Then he's all, and then it, that was, that's all, and they're about to hit the floor, y'all. Celebrity status. Y whoever you are, it's finna happen overnight. Some type of celebrity status, and somebody could be searching for you. Maybe your family all in somebody's ear. Um, and I feel like your family know where you stay, but they're not telling somebody where you stay. I don't know. Discord amongst family and friends. Yeah, God's work. This is God's plans. God's plans. The black magic isn't working on you anymore. You are too strong. Whoever you are, yeah, you're too strong. So I'm getting like, um, the shit is just not working, man. It's not working. <laughs> Bro, they still talk about you like y'all together, okay? Mm, and masculine energy came for the wrong person. Okay, so they still talk about you like y'all together, whoever this person is. And you do have a lot of gossip and shit out here. You know what I'm saying? Someone will gossip about all your secrets, or this could be family, this discord amongst family and friends, or fake ass friends. You got a lot of fake people around, you know what I'm saying? I feel like a lot of fake people gonna come back, but they gonna catch their towel in the midst, you know what I'm saying? So, whoever these people is that's trying to come back, whether it's the brother, the sister, the cousin, the friend, the daddy, the mama, the grandma, the granddad, it don't even matter. They finna have a towel, and I don't, I wouldn't want to be around nowhere around when they catch their towel. You see what I'm saying? So, talking about coming back, bitch, you know you can't come back. You know you can't come back. The closest thing you can do is Astro Project. You can't do shit but Astro Project. That's all you can do. <laughs> You are always, look, you are and always will be good enough, whoever you are. Know that. And you just, you about to see how good you are, okay? I'm saying, like, a lot of people spying on you um, with the spying card. You said blessed in multiple ways. So, you're about to be blessed in multiple ways that you can't even imagine. Do you understand me? 19, 19 on the clock, as I said. You're about to be blessed in so many ways. You, you, look, I'm telling you. Ooh. Betrayal, yeah. So there was some type of betrayal here. What is this betrayal? Yeah, I don't trust anybody at this point. So I feel like you don't trust anybody because of the betrayal 
Okay, we have uh, third, de third degree masons here. Okay, I don't know if they're going to step in and help or I'm getting like, y'all know all of them not bad because y'all know how I feel about this. So, yeah, they're going to help. So, we got third degree masons here. Even if it's not third degree masons, I feel like they're chosen. Whoever you are, you're chosen. And you just about to see how chosen you are, whoever you are. Okay, I don't know. Maybe you need to set your attention. You need to learn how to cloak yourself. I'm here. Do you remember the time oh, I, we fell in love? You remember the time when we first met, girl? I don't know who the fuck, who, who is this? Who are you? Somebody coming for you. Tell me, do you remember the time we first met? But you betrayed me. But you betrayed me, bro. <laughs> but yeah, we got, yes, we got chosen. We got third degree masons. Um, yeah. Yeah, you have to sacrifice some. Whoever this person is, I feel like they tried to sacrifice you. Because, look, I'm telling you, they did some type of ritual or something. Somebody tried to sacrifice you, bro. And then we got the sun card. So, um, the sun came out. Uh, I went about a drop top. Look, somebody tried to sacrifice you. I don't know why I feel like somebody's um, making money off of you or some shit. I don't know. The sun card, something has been illuminated. But I feel like uh, somebody been... Doing some type of spirit work or something. They got this in their flow. And somebody doing some, was doing some type of spirit work on you. That's why we got, um, that's why we have, um, you have to sacrifice something. Somebody tried to sacrifice something. They tried to sacrifice you. Okay, that's the betrayal. That's what the betrayal is. That's why you don't trust anybody at this time, at this point. Yeah. Then look, we have, I want to talk to my lawyer. So if somebody did something, it, it's a betrayal here. Yeah, there's about to be a, be a major disruption. That's the tower, okay? You have a strong connection to the angelic realm. Yeah, whoever you are, you're chosen. There go that three men in black. I can't make this shit up. Did I just tell y'all about three men in black? There you go right there, the three men in black. Mm. You were betrayed by your family. So we do have this quarter amongst family and friends. Okay, your family is about to catch a towel, okay? They're about to catch a towel, but you're about to get some good news. But three men in black, I'm telling you, somebody... Try to cloak themselves so you wouldn't know who the fuck they was. And guess what? I feel like it's a family member. Or it could be three family members. Or it could be somebody that you were dating and your family. Three people. It was three people, though. I feel like it was three men. Three men in black. They cloaked themselves so you wouldn't know who the hell they was. And did some type of spirit work. Because somebody got this in their flow. You know what I'm saying? And they said some intentions to uh, like bring you down. But it didn't cause some type of trouble and accusations, right? It didn't work. It didn't work. Whatever they tried to do, it didn't work. So, let's see. Uh, let me hear up because I don't got a lot of time. Let me see who I'm talking to. You know, I want to clarify this, um, this good news really quick. Okay? Come on. Earth sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I'm not going to be down. Y'all pick that up. We got Aries. We have Sagittarius. What else, spirit? You have any of these signs in your chart. Take what resonates and leave all the rest. Let's see. Aquarius, double confirmation. So you do been dealing with an Aquarius that uh they need to put some respect on your name. I'm hearing. Okay. So we have Taurus here. Let's get one more. Sagittarius, mm. Capricorn, Libra. So it could be any of those signs. You could be any of those signs or have any of those signs in your chart. Okay, so let's see what this um Okay, let's see what this good news is. Okay, spirit, what's this good news that's coming to my collective? I'm hearing you worked hard for this. This is what I'm hearing. You worked hard for this. Okay, see if you can good news. What is this good news? Oh. It says situations in the balance. Um, situation. Situations in the balance that require careful handling. So I'm getting like this situation requires careful handling. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, this is what I'm getting. Some type of good news coming right. 
whatever this good news is, it will cry care for handling it. I do feel like it's like a lot of, uh, man, bro. Rex on Rex on Rex, I'm hearing it. So, look, we have news is on the way, and we have good news. It's definitely some good news on the way. You see that news on the way? And then we have good news here. See, news on the way and good news. But whatever this good news is, it's going to require careful handling. I don't know. Somebody finna, um, a man, the money. I'm hearing this shit loud. I'm hearing, somebody finna get some. I'm hearing compensated. I'm hearing compensated. Uh, let me see this. It said triumph over trouble obstacles. See, trouble don't, don't last always. You know what I'm saying? It may seem like it could be going on 10, 20 years, but it's not going to last always. It's going to get greater later. Great good fortune. I'm telling you, that's what you finna get. Whatever this is you're stepping into, this is some money here. I'm hearing so much money. Somebody finna need to get a uh, a lawyer. And uh, uh okay, so look, somebody finna get a lot of money. I don't know who you is. You finna need a lawyer and a um what you call them people to help you manage your money? One of them people. You're gonna need one of them people, a lawyer. I don't know. I'm, I'm like, is somebody finna win the lottery or something? Cause if you are, I don't know why I'm getting it. But if you are finna win the lottery, you I'm getting like don't cash your okay, spirit said. Don't cash your own. You can't you ain't not gonna be able to turn that ticket in because it's like people gotta it's like when you win the lottery and stuff like that, they have to put it out there to the public. See what I'm saying? And so, like, let's just say you old people or family start coming back around, like, uh, saying that the money there is, and this, you know what I'm saying? All that old type of shit. So, you definitely need a lawyer. And uh, I don't know how the lawyer do that. They might get somebody. They can get somebody to um, cash the check for you and then give you your money. If that makes sense. I think I think that's how they go. And they can give you your money because... um. Yeah, I don't think you would want to cash it yourself, but I'm definitely getting some good, great fortune. Look, good luck. This, this is a, this is some money here. Good, great fortune. She, a good, great fortune. Mm. Yeah, cause okay, I mean, that's what I'm getting. Somebody can need to get um hire somebody. Yep, a wish will be granted. I don't know why I keep hearing wedding planner. I don't know if somebody planning on getting married or whatever this is. I don't know. Somebody's not. Okay, we have muddled, unclear thinking, but it's in reverse. So I don't think, um, maybe, maybe, um, you know. But right is like uh, muddled thinking, unclear. You're unclear about somebody in reverse. I feel like um, your your pathway is, op is open. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm getting with it. Opportunities, possibilities, and paths, and paths opening up. You know what I'm saying? Maybe once upon a time you wasn't seeing things clearly. Maybe things were muddled. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe somebody was seeing you. They weren't seeing clearly in regards to you because of what these two fake face that people were saying or gossiping about you. You see what I'm saying? And maybe people weren't seeing you. They were seeing you in a different light, but now it's a whole new light. And, like, doors are, like, literally opening up for you. You know what I'm saying? People are clear on who you are. You know what I'm saying? They know that you are really a high priest. You know what I'm saying? Or a high priest. High priestess or a high priest. Okay? Sorrow over loss. I feel like this is uh, the people who gossiping about you or gossip about you or the two-faced friends or the family. This sorrow over a loss. Because they lost you. Shit, they lost you and they know. They know they lost you. I feel like they know ain't no ain't no coming back. I, I messed up with that person real bad. I know what I did. I, I shouldn't have done. I know this shit wasn't true. You know what I'm saying? It was far from the truth. But I did it. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's how they feel. And they know they can't come back. Most of everybody that you were dealing with from your past know they talking about you a witch. I mean, I went through the same thing. I'm over saying I'm a witch, this and that. I put my cars up just because. Like, I was like, shit, damn, am I? But shit, I am, you know. I come from a line of them, but I'm not a bad one. You know what I'm saying? It said dealings or relations with the woman. Okay, they could be you or not. And maybe you feel tired and frustrated because, you know, you might be going through a lot. You know, this whole journey is a lot. You know what I'm saying? And, and you might want to get ready for because if you if you accept this journey and you go on this journey, it is not easy. 
Okay, it is not easy, and I'm here to tell you it ain't easy. It's too many cards. Stepping into a new experience, um, and need the help or assistance and guidance. I'm also getting like the people who talked about you. You know what I'm saying? Now they, then now they got their hand that they in need of assistance and guidance. They might even email you. They might need your help or whatever. Because because whoever you are, you will have priestess or have priest. So you reveal things and you do have a responsibility, right? You know, uh, we all are healers and stuff, and you know, et cetera. And we have responsibilities to, um, you know, wake people up and help many people. You know, everybody help in different ways. You know what I'm saying? However you give back, that's how you give back. But, yeah, they going to need you now. Let me hear up y'all, because I got to go. A journey, either physically or mentally. Didn't I tell you, before I even looked at the car, y'all, it's a journey. It's a journey out there. Like, it's a, this this whole this whole spiritual journey is, is one heck of a journey. Okay, dealings or relationships with an old man, and we have reconciliation. Both of these came out together. So, I don't know whoever this older man is to you. They, that's not You couldn't be dealing with him no more, because they want to reconcile with you. Or this could simply just be the people with their hand out wanting to reconcile with you and wanting to come back after that they know what they did to you. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no take backsies. We don't do take backsies. No take backsies over here. We're not doing that. Okay, last card. Okay, February. Somebody's birthday could be in February. Something might be significant about February. I don't know. Uh, you're going to have to take it how it originates here. It's a new news of birth or a new business opportunity. So we have like a lot of cards. We have like three cards talking about opportunities here. So this is two. And it's like three of them, right? So maybe 